Hey, 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 everybody, it's Robin from Roaming with Rover. We've got an unboxing. Today we've got this box and it's from Hershner's. So I'm gonna set it down here next to me because it's a big box. Ugh. And I've already popped the top, so we don't have to fight with that. And we're gonna see what's inside. Oh, we've got a packing list, so that's always nice. So we're gonna see how much we paid for this stuff. And see what we've got in here. And I see yarn. I see a lot of yarn. So what do we have in here? We've got some Hirschner's worsted yarn. I like the Hirschner's worsted yarn. It's a very basic yarn. And I got a lot of it in here. What do we have? We've got a lot of very basic worsted yarn. And I remember why I bought this. I know, surprise, right? Lots and lots of very basic yarn. Ooh, here's a red one. And here's a gray one. And one pack. Okay, what I was doing here, first of all, it was all on sale. I ordered this on November 20th was the date that I ordered this. So it took a while to get here. It was on sale, sort of a Thanksgiving sale, I believe, but I was in the process of making hats and I wanted some very neutral colors to make the base of the hats. But I'm also in the process of making some gnomes and a lot of the gnomes seem to have a lot of very neutral colors for the bases. And that's what I was also looking for, was just some good neutral colors for stuff. And I didn't have any of that. So I went through the list of the worsted, the worsted eight, and just got a lot of neutral colors. And that's what I was doing here. And then this was a set and the sets were on sale too. So let's see what I was paying for. Oh, this was a different one. I'll show you that too. So all of these worsteds, they were on sale for $4.47. And they are, that's antiquity also. That one goes over there. So all of these worsted aids, they, they don't say worsted aid, but it's all the same thing. I double checked when I was ordering it. So all of these worsteds are $4.47 and they are 100% acrylic, 100% acrylic, machine wash and dry, uh, eight ounce, this is an eight ounce skein, 226 grams, 489 yards, 489 yards for $4.47. Let me see if I can do the math on that. I don't know if I'll be able to. First of all, I don't know if I can find the calculator on this phone. There it is. Okay, so we take 4.47 and divide it by, how many yards did I say? 489. So that's not even a penny a yard. That's pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. Okay. And so I bought two, four, six, eight skeins of that. And I think I've got one skein on back order. Well, yeah, these, when on the listing it's called worst today. So these are all worst today. And I've got colors like sandstone and pecan and walnut and espresso and dark gray so a lot of different like i said very very neutral colors and then i have this is called antiquity these are all antiquity that's just a different line and they work up exactly the same as the worst to date i think they're just a little bit different colors worst to date antiquity they're 3.99 a skein, $3.99. They are 100% acrylic, eight ounces, 489 yards. So is that identical? 
400, identical, identical. They're the same weight. They're all four weights. These are made in Turkey. These China, some of these are made in China, some are made in Turkey, just depends on which one you get. Um, I've used both of these, they, they, they work up identical. These colors are a little bit different. This is called Current Brown. Brown? I would not call that brown. Isn't that funny? Oh, Cobble Brown. I still wouldn't call it brown. I would call that a greeny gray color. And Marigold. That is very pretty. Very, very, very pretty. So those were $3.99, so four bucks. And then this is called Wintery Mix. And it's got a nice gray, a nice blue, and a white. I remember wanting this blue. Um, so these are the same as these. And that was for the three pack was $12. So four bucks a piece for those. Four bucks a piece. So even cheaper than these. So pretty darn good deal on that stuff. Okay, but, but, here's, I'm so excited, so excited. I've been wanting this for a very, very long time. And the reason I put this order in over and above getting these on such a good deal. Oh, something I forgot to show you. When you get any of the um, Hirschner's yarns, you get the center pull with the little tag. So it's super easy to find these. You dig in there, there's no digging. You just grab that little tab and away you go. This is what I was excited about. This is what my main order in here was. This is my it's a Knitter's Pride, and it's a pattern holder. How cool is that? Now, I've got a smaller one that I bought probably a year ago, year and a half ago, and I think I got it from Hobie. And so this is, let's unsnap this, and you unfold it. See all those magnets? That's the hold your pattern. And then you snap this to the other side. And I think, I don't know why it's got two, two snaps. Maybe to make it smaller if you want. Snap it to the other side. So there's your V. So now you can put your pattern, you hook your pattern up right there. And this holds it in place. And it also will help hold with your, um, where you're at on your pattern. Like I'm, I'm doing one right now that has a lot of charts which I don't have in here. Oh, I know. We can put this on here. We can put this on here. Pretend this is our pattern. So you can have it up, up and down or you can have it sideways. And we're just gonna stick that on there. And then this would be your little place marker. So just like this, put that on there. Hold it in place, put these where you want to put that on your pattern to show different things, okay? And then the other side, this is a pin holder. There's a pin holder over here. There's a pocket here with a zipper, so you can put your stuff in here. Now, if you've got multiple pages of your pattern, I knocked it off. If you've got multiple pages of your pattern, you can fold up your extra pages and put them inside here, carry them with you. You can put your ruler, you can put some stitch markers, you can put your scissors, um, all kinds of little notions right in there. You wouldn't put a ton of stuff in there, but you can put a couple basic things in there and then you've got this all right ready to go. I am so excited about this. So, so, so excited. And then when you're ready to go, just close the whole thing up and take it with you. Put that right in your your um, project bag and take it with you. And it's got this really pretty design on the outside. And this is soft. This is a soft sort of denim-y feel. Yeah, really, really pretty design on here. 
I'm so excited about this. I really, really am. So that's my very exciting unboxing for today. So I've got some really nice um, neutral colors to work with on some of my upcoming projects and my pattern holder. I'm very excited about this. And even if you wanted, if you've got a pattern that you're using over and over and you wanna put it in one of those plastic sleeves, that's fine, you can still use that on here and just attach it to that with your magnet strip. And uh, a lot of people use those plastic sleeves and then they use a, a marker on the outside of it. That's perfectly fine. You've got room to put a couple of markers in here and you're good to go. So that's my very, very exciting unboxing for today. This was a Hirschner's project, a Hirschner's um, purchase and see if it says how much that was on here and I did have a coupon so I did get a percentage off on this let me see it was $34 for this and I got $18 off so plus plus I had shipping I had a I think it was $4 shipping or something like that I always get I don't buy anything unless I get reduced shipping. So there you are. And I do know when I buy these kind of things, um, you can get more magnets and put on there. I always use a bunch of magnets when I'm doing this kind of stuff. So that was my very exciting. I've been waiting and waiting for this. It did take a while to get here, but I have been waiting and waiting for this. I'm very, very excited for this to get here. So. What do you think? What do you think? Have you guys used these before? Is it everything you expected it would be? I know I'm excited to use it. Thank you guys so much for popping in. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.